Hello everyone welcome to my YouTube channel Iraqi Dinar Update. What's up Dinar community? Today, we're going to talk about something that's been on my mind lately, and it's a topic that might ruffle some feathers. But hey, I'm just here to keep it real, as always. Now, let me preface this by saying that I've got mad respect for everyone in the Dinar community. We've all been on this wild ride together, holding on to our dinar investments and hoping for that life-changing revaluation. But let's be honest, sometimes things can get a little out of hand. You know what really grinds my gears? The fact that there are people out there who claim to be experts on the dinar, spouting off all sorts of nonsense and leading folks astray. I mean, come on. We've all seen those overhyped YouTube videos and forum posts promising the moon and delivering nothing but disappointment. Here's the thing, I could be so drunk that I can't even remember my own name, and I'd still be able to call out these so-called gurus on their BS. It's not rocket science, folks. All it takes is a little common sense and a willingness to question the narratives being pushed by these self-proclaimed insiders. Don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to rain on anyone's parade. We all want to see that revaluation happen, and we're all holding out hope that our investments will pay off big time. But let's keep it real, okay? Let's not fall for every shred of intel or insider information that gets thrown our way. Instead, let's focus on the facts. Let's look at the real economic and political situations in Iraq and the surrounding regions. Let's analyze the moves being made by the central banks and the key players in the global financial system. That's where the real answers lie not in some vague rumor or unsubstantiated claim from some random dude on the internet. And let's not forget, this is a long game. We've been at this for years, and it's likely going to be a while longer before we see any real movement. So, let's take a deep breath, stay grounded, and keep our wits about us. Because at the end of the day, that's what's going to separate the real investors from the get-rich-quick dreamers. Look, I'm not here to tell anyone how to invest their money or what to believe. That's up to each and every one of you. But what I am here to do is to call out the bullshit when I see it, and to remind everyone to stay vigilant, stay skeptical, and most importantly, stay real. Because at the end of the day, even if I'm so hammered that I can't string two words together, I'll still be able to see through the smoke and mirrors. And that's something that no amount of fancy intel or self-proclaimed expertise can ever hope to match. So, the you have it, Dinar fam. That's just my two cents on the matter. Take it or leave it, but remember. I'm always going to keep it 100 with you all. Because that's what real investors do as they deal in facts, not fiction. Peace out. Thanks for the watching my video and subscribe to my YouTube channel Iraqi Dinar Update.